welcome aboard the Minesweeper, a really quite unusual venue in London. It's, uh, it's a boat which has been used for many artistic and dance and cabaret gigs, music. It's a great favourite with uh, the underground scene really in London, but unfortunately, uh, recently, there was a bit of a problem which was the whole boat caught fire. So we're going to go and find out now exactly what's been happening here. We're going to talk first of all to Camden, who is the instigator, the founder and the funder and the runner of the whole venue. I've been here for about five years, running events here and uh, just trying to turn it into a floating venue. But unfortunately, just two nights ago, Saturday the 13th, something rather unfortunate happened. Okay, should we go and have a look? Let's go and have a look. Okay. Yeah. There was a big fire uh, right back here. Which is sort of made a bit of a, a bit of a hole. And we lost lots of um, timber and tools and all this kind of thing. So, um, you know, basically this has set the project back. We were just kind of getting to grips with this space. We just started to build a recording studio under here, um, which we'd got some funding from the Escarman Trust for. Um, it's a lovely theatre because I came here and this, this, this is was, the theatre. This is the stage, yeah. This is where the flamenco concert was. Yeah, so that's right. It, we've seriously sort of been set back here, so we don't know what's going to be possible um, in the future. We're going to carry on doing events because most fortunately the fire brigade ar arrived very, very promptly and really tackled it, you know, within a few hours. What? Tackled it? What? Why is that funny? <laughs> they did. <laughs> well, it could, you know, it could have been a lot worse. No, could have been a lot worse. But it didn't go any further than this, so that's lucky. You know, it hasn't destroyed the project, which it could have. It's salvageable. But it's, yeah. How much money do you think you're going to need to get it back to where you were before? I would think about £10,000. Um, just in terms of materials. I mean, we had a lot of timber stored here, um, which we'd acquired and we bought with, with grant money and so on, and we were storing it in the back here, just ma mainly to do the redecking, because there's, a lot of this deck was in quite poor condition anyway before. Um, but now that timber has all been destroyed, so we've, you know, we're back to square one. We've still got some to be dry, and that, that hasn't been too badly damaged. So I think we can we can carry on, and we can we can do stuff. But we are going to need now to seriously raise funding and replace those materials, and we need to hire a lot of guys who know what they're doing. Last night when the fire brigade were here, nobody's looking for a light. 